Hi guys, this is a video review of Orcators G500V Plus, an excellent underwater video light. So let's have a look. It has four modes of operation, maximum power, medium, low power and a strobe mode. Uh, later you will see how to activate each one. That's my setup, which uh, I'm uh, using for the test. On the left hand side is the video light, on the right hand side was the primary light. So this is a shot with the video light and you can see how nice the colors are. And that's without the light. Uh, that's a shot with the primary light I've used for the setup, just to show you how narrow is the beam. That's the primary light I've used and the stop frame shows how narrow the beam is. And uh, that's the video light itself and that's the 120 degrees angle I'm talking about later. Uh, that's another shot with the video light, uh, you can see how vivid, how bright the colors are and the yellow is coming back, the red is coming back thanks to this great uh, dive light. Very easy for uh, underwater operation thanks to the magnetic switch so you can switch it off and on uh, whenever you need it um, without any problems for flooding the light or anything like this. Orca Torch D500V Plus comes in an excellent packaging. Let's have a look in the specification. 1000 lumens maximum beam output, 18 hours 30 minutes maximum run time, 318 meters maximum beam distance, 25300 candelas uh, beam intensity, 1 meter drop resistant and 150 meters underwater resistant. So let's open the package and see what's inside. Uh, you can see a very nice padding, so the suitcase is very well made and uh, Orcator gives you a very nice lanyard, three spare o-rings, hand strap, uh, Orcator D500V Plus user manual in uh, two languages, English and Chinese, uh, Orcator warranty card, again in uh, Chinese and English and that's Orchid Torch G500V Plus. Let's have a more detailed look in this excellent uh, video light. The body itself is made from aircraft grade high strength aluminium with a black matte finish which is actually a type 3 military hard anodized seawater corrosion resistant finish. Uh, the body itself has a very nice grip properties thanks to uh, several flat surfaces so you can grip the light with a bare hand or with gloves. Uh, those two flat surfaces will ease you when you want to undo the light. At the back of uh, the body you can see the two cutouts which are made for a linear attachment. The front part of the dive light contains the magnetic switch the head and the high water pressure resistant lens with the Orca Torch logo. Let's disassemble the video light. Orca Torch may supply you with a battery but bear in mind that some countries have import restrictions so you might need to buy your own battery. You can fit inside the body one 18650 battery or two CR123A or two 16340 batteries. You can see the thread inside, it's a high density per inch thread, very nice uh, thread for a dive light. Uh, and that's the battery I'm using, 18650. Uh, the body itself has Orca Torch logo on both sides. And uh, pretty much that's it. That's the head, it has the integrated circuit with reverse polarity protection the dive thread with high density per inch thread, a three o-rings giving you a maximum underwater protection, the magnetic switch, the front high pressure resistant lens, uh, the Cree diode providing you 1000 lumens beam output and Orca Torch logo printed on the reflector. Let's assemble the video light and uh, give it a go. In order to activate the video light, just press the magnetic switch once and this will activate the high power beam mode. 
Now I'm going to show you the 120 degrees beam angle, a very important feature for every video light. Uh, thanks to the excellent uh, reflector, you can achieve uh, 120 degrees wide beam angle. Each time when you press the magnetic switch, you activate a different mode and when you hold the magnetic switch, uh, that's the stroke mode, a very useful feature in case of a distress situation. That's the wrist strap, uh, a very nice addition to D500V Plus uh, kit. It has Orchitorch logo, a D-ring, that's the video light uh, holder with a rubber finish from the inside and uh, soft material from the outside. That's how you put the wrist strap on your wrist and that's how you tighten the wrist strap. Now I'm going to show you how to insert the video light. You can insert the video light like this and uh, another nice feature of this wrist strap is that while using the video light you can equalize your nose with your fingers. You can switch on the video light, point and shoot the object you're interested in. Actually you can use this wrist strap with uh, an pretty much every other video light so it's a multi-purpose multi-function wrist strap. Uh, that's my other uh, Orchid Torch uh, dive light, very nice, uh, I use it for a primary light. And uh, that's the Lanyard, a standard feature to every Orchid Torch dive light, that's how you attach it and uh, that's how you put it on your wrist. Overall that's uh, Orchid Torch D500V+. I would like to thank Orchitor's team and especially Anita for giving me the opportunity to test and review this excellent underwater visual light.